Michaela J LLC, which is a luxury success coaching brand and also Stardust Designs, which is a clothing and product line. Um, hi, a lot of you may already know you me, know me, but I decided I was going to commit to doing 30 days of YouTube in May. So basically I'm going to be doing a video every freaking day. I have no idea what about. It might be vlogs. It might be my morning routines. It might be sit down videos. I honestly don't know, but I'm just gonna do it, you know, because I always say that I'm going to be doing YouTube. I always say that me and my team are gonna figure out YouTube because I have a team of employees. I always say that I wanna do all these YouTuber things, but then I never make fucking YouTube videos. So that's the team. So we're changing that and I'm actually going to be making the fucking YouTube videos. So today's a crazy day because Stardust Designs, my second business, is launching. This is a product line and clothing line. I'm wearing a sweatshirt from the line right now. It has the same design as my tattoo. A lot of um, the pieces in the collection have the same designs as my tattoos or they have stars that are like my tattoos. It's like a very mystical, spiritual, like cute uh, clothing, luxury loungewear brand is what I like to call it. And then we have mugs and bags and stuff and everything is so fucking soft. But the website's launching today. So we are finishing taking photos, uploading everything to the website, getting ready to go. It's going to be launching in like three hours which is crazy got my daily starbucks i've been super into sugar-free vanilla lattes with coconut milk lately and we're just gonna go through the morning routine made my bed got my coffee took a bunch of flat lays for the website that we need to get posted and then now i'm just listening to spotify i just took off my makeup from the night before because i fell asleep with it on so i need to do my skincare routine and then we're gonna do our daily journaling and all the things a bunch of legal documents so I'm in the process of getting a house in Los Angeles and there's just a lot of paperwork that has to be done and I had to basically register my business because it'll be going through my business to get the funds for the house and just lots of confusion but just finished the operating agreement minutes and a document allocating the funds and all the legal boring things that we don't want to talk about but now I put on something comfy and we're gonna go and get smoothies. So I'm super hungry. Very excited for a smoothie. And then I wanna get in a workout before the site launches. I look super ratchet right now. And I put on my robe because I'm really cold and we keep almost all the windows open in my apartment. But got my smoothie king. Um, the site's launching in an hour. I'm freaking out. Well, actually 45 minutes, 44 minutes for being really specific. I'm freaking out. 
Normally I would like get dressed and wear a cute outfit and do my hair and makeup and all of that, but I like to exercise before I get ready. So we're gonna go on a walk after this light uh, after the site is launched. And then I have two workout videos I'm going to do. I've been doing the Bailey Brown workout videos. She has the brand or like the app BB Fit, but I've been doing her free YouTube videos and my ass is so sore. Those workouts are really good. So I have two like five minute um, workout videos picked out from her that I'm gonna do today after the walk and then we will get ready and freak out and celebrate as we launch the site it's absolutely crazy i've never sold a physical product before so we have no idea what to expect sales wise i don't know what like potential issues to expect but i think everything will run very smoothly the way the interface is set up with the website and the orders it's very simple so it should all go accordingly but I just don't know what to expect because I've never done it before and I'm really freaking excited. We've been hyping it up for like a week now. We are actually, we've been working on all this for about two months and then we did the photo shoot with our model and our photographer on Sunday and when I'm filming this, it's Friday, May 1st, which you guys will see this video tonight. Um, and anyway, so I posted it on my story, like behind the scenes of the photo shoot and everybody freaked out on Instagram. So I was like, oh my God, we have to ride this clout and like launch the Instagram. So we've been posting on the Instagram every day, a couple of times a day. It's been a whole thing and freaking out. It's a great time. Also my Smoothie King order, I always get the dark chocolate banana smoothie. It's the vegan one. Today is Friday, so it's $5 Friday for the huge one. And then I add peanut butter and cold brew. So, so fucking good. It's a meal replacement smoothie, so this is my lunch. I had my coffee today, which is a sugar-free vanilla latte with coconut milk. Um, I'll probably have another coffee in the afternoon. Usually I have two coffees a day, so we shall see. And now I'm just nervous talking. I need to go write an email and then write a mini chat blast, which will send to like Facebook Messenger for when the website goes live. So I'm gonna go do that now and try and calm down and breathe. <laughs> website just launched. Three people checking out already. It's what time is it? <laughs> okay. 12:15. Three people are already checking out. I'm gonna vomit everywhere. Freaking out. I'm freaking out. Update. Order has been made from Kim. 17 people on the website, all over. Let's see, we, got, we have some Netherlands in the UK going. Who knows where else? I can't navigate this with one hand. Currently on a walk, now vlogging on my phone. <sighs> Didn't want to bring the whole camera. Usually I don't even bring my phone on walks because I like to be really present on my walks because I like to look at the sky and I love looking at the dandelions. Just connected with nature. Like look how beautiful it is so gorgeous but taking a break from launch craziness which actually not taking a break because connor is monitoring the emails like a crazy person and i'm answering dms about sizing but at least we can get out and move our bodies not stare at the computer screen freaking out over every single person who's on the website even though it's super exciting um yeah i'm just freaking out the orders are coming in i'm freaking out it's nice and warm out today. All I want is an iced coffee and it is what it is. We are post walk, post second Starbucks run for the day. This is just um, a triple, oh, there's a hair on that. There's, this is just a triple shot of espresso over ice in a venti cup. I add more ice and then I just put oat milk in it when I'm at home and sometimes some cinnamon and just make it a vibe. But. Oh my goodness, so we launched the merch site, everything's going great. We have orders coming in and people messaging me that they're saying they're gonna order, they're excited to shop, people are emailing me saying congrats, they love everything. So it's just been really amazing getting all this support. Um, and I just got home, we went on a walk and then grabbed Starbucks and I just got home and I got an email from the Tesla financing people um, about like some issue with my car and the car payments like weren't going through or something with my account, something like stupid. And 
I'm just like, fuck. I feel like, especially as a business owner, I have my hands in a lot of different projects all the time. So it's like, okay, I have my hands in like helping with PR stuff and figuring out that plan. And then we have social media stuff and I have my business and then helping with clients. And then we have launches, new programs, merch. And then like at the same time, I'm getting a house. There's just all these things happening all the time. And it feels like when I can finally put down one project, like merch is launched, done. We don't have to think of or worry about that anymore. It's like, great, now I gotta pick another thing with the car issue and I'm just like fuck can I catch a goddamn break I just feel so I don't know I literally can just never catch a break basically um which is interesting an interesting pattern for me to dig into on in my own personal work so that's the vibe right now um I was I need to do my workout for the day I'm feeling really tired and kind of hungry um, the Tesla thing really like set me back. Like I'm just confused about what's going on there. So now I need to figure all of that out. Um, but yeah, so we're going to make the rest of this coffee. Like I said, just add more ice and oat milk that I have at home. Put in some cinnamon. It smells so good. Do my little workout videos and then get to work on all of the things for work today because I haven't even started work today other than launching the merch stuff. So crazy freaking day holy sweaty wearing our merch sports bra just got in a good sweat with that workout oh my goodness i did two five minute workout videos one was like a small waist ab blaster and one was an inner thigh blaster and to say it was shaking was an understatement so i wanted to show you guys my coffee after i make it all up the lighting is kind of weird over here of the window but this is what it looks like after i just add my own oat milk so when i was done with my workout it probably had like this much coffee because the ice started to melt and so then i added about this much of the oat milk and just added some extra ice at the top so there's my little latte it costs like two bucks <laughs> maybe three dollars and yeah it's great also look at how cute my computer is with all of our mj stickers i have them backwards so when you open up the computer like somebody can look at it aren't they so pretty you can buy them on my merch website which i'll have linked in the description but now we're gonna go get ready so what has changed since the last time we've chatted i got ready did my makeup put my hair in a little bun hopefully that little spin didn't look stupid i have no idea what that looked like looked like um i ate a snack i'll have to show you guys um when i leave my room again what i love to eat for a snack they're like these crispy snap pea things you'll know what i'm talking about when i show you the bag but i'm obsessed with them they're so freaking good so i had a snack all i've had today is that smoothie it's like a, it was a meal replacement smoothie but i was getting really hungry and a snack sat on the couch for a bit i'm feeling really 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 freaking tired um like i could just take like a three hour nap right now but we got shit to do baby i need to do a live video today is the last day for early bird for a new course that i'm launching next week which is super exciting so i need to do a little live video talk about that and talk about the early bird promo ending and then i just have a lot of like little things that need to be done paperwork work things typical daily tasks check in with my clients check in with all my facebook groups all of the things all of the time figure out the tesla situation um yeah like i said pick up one project put down one project and pick up another is kind of the story of my life so that's what i'm gonna do i need to do like some jumping jacks jumping jacks or something and wake me up I also am going to have to edit this video later. I don't have the cord, so I'm going to have to like upload these clips to my phone because I have the type of camera where you can upload things straight to your phone. So I'm going to have to upload it to my phone and then put it in my Google Drive and then edit after that. So crazy freaking day. Crazy, crazy day. But let's keep going. It's like 3.30 p.m. We can do this. We can do this. And for dinner, I'm making stuffed peppers, which I'm really excited about because it's one of my favorite meals. And I'm gonna have that with some tater tots with potato olays from Taco John's and a giant Diet Pepsi. Fun fact about me, I love Diet Pepsi. It's kind of my thing right now. So I'm gonna have that. And yeah, we'll see what all gets done. 
the rest of the day if I can stay awake to be announced. Doing my Facebook Live. <laughs> Just finished my live and some IG stories. Yeah, I literally still have my coffee. Um, I'm getting hungry. I'm really excited to cook dinner, cook stuffed peppers, get to buy a Pepsi. It's just going to be such a vibe. Um, I wanted to talk about, we're going to wrap up the vlog after I talk to you about this, but I think this will be really interesting and helpful for anybody who's an entrepreneur. So with my business, I run an energetic business. So what does this mean? This means that my vibration and how I'm feeling and my excitement around business is what creates my results. So when I'm really excited about something, I know it's going to sell well. I know that a lot of people are going to download the podcast or watch the video or share the live whatever because it's based off my vibration when I'm in the wealth vibes I call in more wealth when I am in like the loving connection vibes I call more people into my community whether that's a free or a paid community it's because I run an energetic business and so I really pride myself on that and really connecting with the universe to deliver what the people need to hear so today when I was getting ready I literally just downloaded the topic for my live video I realized that all this shit has been so crazy in my life lately like I was saying earlier the second I put down a project something else pops up into my lap and I realized that was all because of something I was asking for in my life and I'm just learning the lessons in order to prepare my Myself to receive that next level thing and um, I was just coming to this conclusion myself and I was like holy shit this is such a good topic to share with people on like people need to hear this so I was like that's exactly what my live video needs to be I knew I wanted to do a live today but I didn't know what about and I knew I wanted to talk about my new program conscious creator but I didn't know how I wanted to share about it or if I wanted to share about it in a live all that but then I got that download for the program and I know that once I get that download somebody even if it's just one person someone needs to hear what I have to say here so then I feel obligated energetically to go live and talk about that thing so that's what I did. I just got downloaded the topic and I'm like, okay, I'm going to get on. I'm going to do this thing and it's going to connect and people are going to love it and it's going to make sense. And it's going to be beautiful and great. And over like 50 people watched it on Instagram and it was amazing. So that's what I do for my lives. I just tap into what am I feeling called to talk about? What have I learned today? What it got downloaded to me? What do the people need to hear? And then I just share on it. I don't really prepare notes. I just know the topic and I talk and talk and talk which I get better at over time. I think everybody does. I'm not one who's really shy of cameras or talking. It doesn't bother me. So I can just talk and if I forget what I'm saying, I'll just be like, oh my God, I lost my train of thought. And I'll just sit there and I don't really care. Some people that really like makes them nervous or it gives them anxiety, I don't really care. But yeah, so I just do that and that's kind of how I come up my lives. And I know that what I'm talking about will always in some way connect to what I'm selling. So with my lives, I always sell something on it because I'm a business, you know, if you're not selling something, you're not a business. I'm always selling an offer or a program or something. And I always just trust that the message that comes through for me will end up connecting to what I am selling when I go on the live video. So if you are a business owner and you were running an energetic business, that's exactly what I do. I just get myself in the vibes. I get downloaded the topic. I just trust that it's going to connect with the theme that I'm selling or offering. And then boom. It's just a magical masterpiece. So that's my crazy fucking day. You guys have seen the ups and downs. It starts with coffee. It starts with making my bed. And then we go into daily rituals and then we attack the day. And then we come back to rituals when we are upset. And then when we're annoyed, we just get ourselves excited again. And we take walks and we have more coffee. And it's just resetting the vibe over and over and over again. Resting when you're really tired. Boosting yourself up when you have shit to do just a typical day in my life. Wow. Yeah, it's going to be a crazy May. I'm excited to be here with you guys and have you watch every bit of it. It's going to be fucking crazy. So thank you for hanging out with me today. Thank you for watching a crazy launch day in Michaela J world. Um, follow me on Instagram. If you're not already, I'm at the Michaela J, which will be in the description and on the screen. Um, don't forget to subscribe because like I said, I'm going to be going live every single day. So you don't want to miss anything, but I will talk to you tomorrow.